I'm just letting y'all know if my video messes up, this ain't going up. Crusty Cray. Pizza. It is the pizza for you and me. Text. found my contacts for today's video i'm gonna be doing how do i do my makeup in five minutes well it's probably not five minutes but it's like super easy and i'm not the type to do the most with my makeup why you ask because i don't know how to so i'm putting in my contacts because i'm actually like this is low-key me getting ready for a video but i was like i should film like how i do my makeup so quick because it literally takes me like two seconds to do my makeup and yeah and i am gonna pop on a wig because i'm doing a video i'm doing another video after this so basically this is like a get ready with me before i do my video but i just want to say i just filmed a video right it was so cute and i was just having a really bad day so i was like i'm just gonna film and talk about it and half the video was good but then the other half wasn't i don't know why i don't know if my sound went out on my mic but it made that really loud noise that i'll be telling you guys about if the clip's still on my computer then i'll slide in a clip of what it sounded like because it was horrible and yeah so hopefully it doesn't do that this time i don't know what was going on for that to even happen i really don't know so but i did test the mic out before i started this video so hopefully we're good so yeah i think that's all i had to say because i always forget what i wanted to say in the beginning so let's get on with the video so today i am getting ready to make a video basically is what i'm doing because my girlfriend comes later by the time this video goes up she'll probably be here so yeah but i'm putting moisturizer on my face i don't use primer because i just like moisturizer better um, i'm using cerave cerave i really need to know how that's pronounced because in my last video that you guys will not see i was trying to figure out the whole time how to say that i'm trying to think like do i really need my starbucks i don't know so yeah so let's like take a cute thumbnail with my face like this i don't know i don't know what to do for the thumbnail so i'm gonna be putting my lashes on and maybe my lip gloss you know so that's what we're about to do so this is actually gonna be accurate but i'm going to explain the little things that i don't do normally but because i am making a video today i want it to look extra nice so one thing that i normally do not do is my eyebrows so i will take this foolproof brow powder from benefit and i'll just fill in my eyebrows because sometimes hair be falling out so every time i do that but today i'm actually gonna like crisp out my eyebrows because i think it would look nice people just keep texting me Alrighty, so let's get started so i use this to do my eyebrows so basically i'm going to use my foundation which is laura mercier flawless lumiere radiance perfecting foundation so i do need something to put this on i guess i'll just put it on my hand whatever i don't use that much i just use a squirt because i'm not doing the most so we're just gonna fill in my eyebrows like make them look crispy let me turn this just a wee bit because i am gonna be getting close so i'm doing the outline first as you guys can tell go in and like I just go in and like do a little swipe so I know what to work with. And now I'm just cleaning them. I can't believe how much my eyebrows grow, like that's sick. I literally just got my eyebrows done. Just to give it that crisp effect, y'all see? Period. <laughs> I really hope this is not messing up. I had to do my makeup anyway, so if this video is messed up, then I mean, I got my makeup done. Like the video that I was doing, I was getting ready, which was like cool, whatever. But like when you mess it up, it's like, are you fucking kidding me? This is my day today. Like this is what's gonna go on today, for real. So I'm gonna take my sponge. I need to get a new one to be honest. I've had this one for so long, and I do clean my brushes. I don't. I clean them like once a year because I do my makeup once a year. So they don't get cleaned often, but this gets cleaned a lot because I use this more than anything. Like, listen, 
If you want to give me tips on how to do my makeup better, go ahead. But don't be mean. Like, people be so mean and be like, she don't know how to do makeup. This makeup looks like how I did it in high school. And blase, blase, blase. And I really don't care when you're talking mean to me. Like, I don't care. Like, you can say whatever you want because I don't do my makeup. So, therefore, if you want to, like, educate me on something, do that. You don't have to be a bitch. <laughs> you don't have to be a bitch, Karen, okay? You don't have to be a fucking bitch. So, oh, by the way, I'm doing my eyebrows. So, I use the lighter one because my eyebrows are dark, but this like gives it enough it's not too overwhelming and makes my eyebrows look super dark period not perfect but who likes perfect people nobody i don't like being perfect i don't want to be perfect <laughs> i sound shitty so eyebrows done period so next i'm gonna do my foundation no, I'm not. <laughs> so, okay, listen. So, I have something I want to tell you guys. So, I learned from Meg the Stallion because I use concealer sometimes, but I don't like how it looks. It leaves creases. I have creases under my eyes, and I don't know how to get rid of it. I've tried everything. She just uses a lighter foundation, so I still haven't got one. So, we're just going to, like, dab, literally, a little bit of concealer on there. And it's probably going to be masked, to be honest. Like, you see that? That's going to go a long way. Um, oh, and you guys are really gonna talk about how I do my foundation, but it works for me. And concealer, I don't know, concealer isn't my thing. I use foundation for my eyebrows, so like I don't really like concealer like that to be honest. But it just masks that like I'm tired 24-7 look, so there we go. So I'm actually going to take the foundation and I put it on my face just like. I really try to start off small and there's always extra so I just like wipe it. And then if I need more, I get more. So first I take this brush. This is actually a blush contouring but I use it for foundation. And I, I go towards my face. I take the foundation and I go towards my face. Right here I go down, obviously, but... so I bought this brush a minute ago. Actually, it was this brush, but I don't like this brush. It's not too harsh. This is from Sephora. It's a 47. It's a foundation brush, but I don't really like it. I like the harsher feel, so that's why I use this one. The thing is going towards my face. If you know what I'm saying, like my face, <laughs> like this part, I always push it that way. I'm like y'all this is my shade ain't it remember i made that video i didn't even i posted on my instagram tv one because the video sucked two the makeup sucked but then i face tuned it and it did justice <laughs> like so i just posted on my instagram tv but like my makeup my foundation was so bad and it was from fenty okay listen i have gotten two different shades from there and they just didn't work literally two different shades and everything and they just didn't work it just it wouldn't connect to my skin and I actually got I actually got the BB cream I think I don't know the difference between BB and CC cream but I got the BB cream or one of them in Laura Mercier because I asked her I said I need something light I don't need something crazy that's gonna make me look super cakey and she gave me that but then when I went back in I was like I might as well just get the foundation why not so then that's why I got this foundation and look y'all like I don't even have to go to my neck <laughs> I just spit period okay so now i'm just checking to make sure everything is cool so i actually am gonna do a little bit more on this side pat here pat here and a little more on this side because your girl got acne and we're trying to cover up the acne did i not text him back and this part right here i'm not i'm just itching i'm not using a brush i'm gonna actually use the sponge because the sponge works better in those areas and it actually works better in like the nose areas too i just wiped all the foundation over it so when i go through with that i grab some oil so this is coconut oil it's raw coconut oil it's just in this packaging because because it is and i take a little bit and i let it seep in yep there you go and then i dip it in water i guess it's kind of pointless i don't know but I just dip it in water just so it's not too oily. And then I'll go over all of this so we don't have those blend marks. Those little screeches and scratches on your face. I really want to try out one of those silicone sponges. I couldn't think of what they were called.
Now I'm gonna go like this to get it on my eyelids so my eyelids aren't different colors than my face, period. Right in the middle because it's really hard to focus right there with a brush. So this is what we're doing. Okay, yes, so this doesn't really cover up my acne that much. I'm not going to lie. I think I'm gonna do right here real quick. And then with the sponge, I just like focus on the little areas like up here. And trust me, this video is gonna be longer than five minutes. But the point of that is that this only takes me five minutes if I'm not sitting here explaining everything that I'm doing. Period, okay, so I'm done. No, I'm just joking, kitty. Okay, so the next step is bronzer. I don't really know how to work this stuff. I do take the same brush that I use for my foundation and I dip it in the bronzer, get some of that off and then Lightly, literally so light go around my face because I don't really know much about this stuff. <laughs> so therefore, I just like dab that shit on. Really makes my jawline look snatched. Kidding. That's what I do though. So the next thing that I do is literally nothing. So I did my foundation, I did my face. So what I do with this powder, baby. <laughs> Y'all really finna talk about me because, I mean, I don't know. I'm not a makeup guru. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing for real. So, this is what I do. I take this brush. It has blush on it. It doesn't really matter. So, I take this brush right here. This is from Sephora. It's, no, this is from Beauty Planet. It's a powder blush brush. So, I take this. I dip it in here. You guys see all that? Ugh, I don't even want to move it. And then I put the rest in the sink. Tap that bitch a couple times because we don't need all that. My phone just won't stop ringing. In. so listen this is what i do i just go like this <laughs> so my face doesn't look weird and listen this bronzer i showed you okay so the only thing i didn't show you i didn't show you my bronzer this is the bronzer it's sun stalker island tings ting island ting from fenty and then the powder is also from Fenty, but this one is actually mixed. So it's mixed with banana and honey, I think it's called. I'm not 100%, but I had to mix them because the honey was too dark and the banana was too light. So I mixed them together. I don't know, this just makes my face look so much different to me, maybe not to y'all, but it makes a big difference in my eyes. And whose eyes matter? Mine. Right, so we're done with it. Now it's time to do the highlighter and the blush, which is like my favorite part because I like to look nice and shiny. So this is Hustle Baby and Mean Money. It's mixed. So I take this brush. So this is from Vanity Planet as well. It's an angled contour brush. And I take it. Oh, I think I got that stuff in my eyes. And wing, wing, period, honey. So we just want that like subtle little that bitch look. And I don't really get the point of that, but I see other people do it, so I do it. And then I wipe off the excess because sometimes I put way too much, like I just did. All right. So now we're gonna take this brush again off. I am taking this. Hold on, y'all. I'm taking this. It's Sensual by Tarte. This is a blush, and I always use a tool to open it because it's so hard. And we're gonna take the blush. That's what it looks like. And I'm going to smuggle this in there. Sounds like I'm smuggling some drugs. And tap it once, bing, and then smile. Boom, that's it. Literally just like boom, boom, boom on my face. Cause look at that. Look at that, sis! Oh my gosh, okay, like you could tell. You see my hairline and then the foundation? Gross, good thing we're putting on a wig. And that's it. <laughs> That's it for the makeup portion. So I am gonna put some of this Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray on my face. And then we're going to pop on some lashes from where, honey? So Serenity. A lot of people have been asking me. They love the lashes that I love. So I love Extended. This is from my brand. If you did not know, honey, it's from my brand and Everybody keeps asking me, where'd you get your lashes from? Where are they at? What's the site? And I feel so bad because it's not up yet. But at least I'm getting y'all excited. Like y'all know. Y'all know that this masterpiece is gonna come out very soon. Why do I look orange? It ain't me, it's the ring light. 
So this is how I take off lash glue. I'm pretty sure this is just how you do it. If there's any other ways, let me know because once I start this business, I'm definitely gonna be doing like some tips or like five minute things and stuff to do with lashes and lip gloss and other things. So therefore, if you know any other way, let me know. Did I just say I wasn't gonna do this on camera? Maybe I thought it, but I didn't say it. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go dry this real quick because I dry it in front of my, I dry it in front of my fan and I'm not trying to sit here for 10 minutes. I just put on my lashes because why i don't know maybe if you want like a how to do lashes video one day i don't know but i was like i'm just gonna do it because i like to do it in my mirror in my room anyways y'all are about to talk about me about how i'm about to do this wig but i don't really care because i'm about to make a video all right so this is what i do first i take my spray bottle i spray my hair it's in good so it's wet I take a brush and I brush it all to the back as much as I can. All the baby hairs and all this stuff. So this wig I put on funny because it has bangs. So I'm like, I don't really have to do the most, you know? So therefore, y'all about to see what I do. I don't even care. So if you see this wig on my head, this is what it looks like. So I braid my hair nice and tight. Not really, I don't really care that much. This video is gonna be like, how do you make up in five minutes? And then the video is 20 minutes long. <laughs> it's really not gonna be that long though. Cause I cut out so much in my video. So I take, I put everything in here because oh my gosh, it was just all over the place. So I take a bobby pin. See my braid? I pin it to my head. So I don't do the most. I just pin it to my head. So I put this on my head. So this is not, this ain't brushed or nothing. Here we go y'all. I don't even glue it down. <laughs> if I didn't glue it down, it would look horrible. So I do have my hot comb right here, by the way, and I also have my blow dryer. I couldn't think of what it was called. All right, y'all, so this is what I do. I glue down the sides and that's it. So can someone like make me feel better down below and tell me they do the same thing with wigs like this? Because I don't want to feel crazy. So I'm just gonna take one side, flip it back. I don't even really gotta flip it back. I could just like move it back. I take my got to be glue. It's really not good to use your finger just because the oils and stuff and it makes it look flaky, but who's really gonna see this? Take this. Maybe I'll say like 10 minutes, <laughs> I don't know. All right, so this is what I do, y'all. So I make sure that the bangs are long enough, but not too long to like get into my lashes. So this is like a good length right here. And then I take the wig, push it onto the glue, and then finish blow drying it. Seems pretty glued down to me, but we'll find out in a second because it'll definitely lift if it's not. So now I'm going to take the other side. So this part's actually super easy because like I already basically know where it's going. So flip it back or push it back, but I prefer to flip it back on this side because the other side's already glued down. Take some stuff, literally put it on my edges. <laughs> I am gonna fix this bottom part though because I don't always have my hair pushed up like this and you'll be able to see that. But first we are going to work on the bangs. Cause y'all see this? This is like how I used to wear my bangs when I was in high school. So y'all probably asking what's going on with my bangs and my wig and all this stuff. So the bangs I'm actually gonna fix with the flat iron, but these extra hairs, so we're gonna do this. I'm gonna do this for right now. The other hairs, when I made this wig, I cut too much bang. I wanted it to look like how it does now, but it didn't, I put too much bang. So therefore, I had to put some on the top, which isn't a problem because I make it blend because I'm that bitch. And honestly, the thing I like about just gluing down the sides and not the top, like say my bangs were up here, I could just pull my wig down <laughs> to be honest with you. So we're just gonna take, let me part it. I'm always losing this comb because we definitely want it down the middle. Got some glue in that area, so we're gonna do this. And then we're gonna blow dry it because you don't wanna flat iron something wet.
So I'm gonna grab my flat iron real quick so we could just have like, we could just take that out the equation once I'm done. This is a very shitty flat iron, but I'm just doing things and I'm not doing my whole head. I don't know, I've been into like super like curly or wavy wigs, but one day I'm gonna wear a straight wig. I haven't worn a straight wig in a long time. Ah, um, okay. Set that over there, boom. So we're just gonna take this hot comb and we are going to flatten it out. Y'all hear that? Cause it's still, uh -uh. I'm gonna have to brush that part out. It won't even let me go through with the brush. Oh, I should have showed y'all the difference. I should have showed y'all the difference. Oh my goodness. That made such a difference. So one time I was doing this wig and I did the hot comb right here, that wasn't really a good idea. I definitely should do that off camera, or not off camera, but off my head, because that shit left a mark on my head. Or maybe I just like sat it for too long, I'm not sure. Yeah, y'all see that? It's okay though. Cause we gonna glue that bitch down. Okay, cute. So now we're gonna take this part and we gonna fix it up because it looked crazy. When off camera, I cleaned up guys cause you know what we do on this channel. Clean up. So I take it by portions just because I don't want it all to be in the same direction. See, it's trying to play me now. It's trying to play me now. Oh, but you know this piece, I actually have to take the glue and glue down. That's why it feels like this. It doesn't stay down for some reason. Just that part though. And we're literally adding like a tiny curve as we go. And I'm not gonna brush that part out yet because I wanna do this part. But like the sliveriest of the slivery curves that you can do, because I like it more straight blunt than like curly and curved. Like my mom's bangs are super curved, period, honey. TikTok, I'm on my way. <laughs> like I'm gonna make TikTok. So when y'all see me in this, they're gonna be like, oh shit, that was from her TikTok. This is cute, okay, yes, we did that. So I'm gonna glue down these edges, these edges. I'm gonna glue down these ends real quick and then put on some clothes so I'll be back. This is real, this is me. I'm exactly where I'm supposed to be now. This is it y'all, this is me. Mm -hmm. This is like, okay, in reality, because I know this video is probably not, I don't know how long the video is going to be, to be honest, but this would take me 10 minutes if I didn't explain everything I had to do and say like I had to go somewhere real quick and I had to hurry up. This would have took 10 minutes. The wig probably would have took five in reality because it does not take that long to glue two sides and straighten the bangs. All I did with my hair is just put some water on it and put some mousse on it. <laughs> So this is it y'all, this is me, QT. I'm finna film another video. I might do like an Instagram TV too, I don't know. But this is all guys, so this is the end of the video. If you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you follow all my social media, it will be on the screen. I do have a gaming channel, so make sure you go check that out. I'm gonna start doing so many different games on there. And I have some merch that is 30% off until the end of the month, so make sure you check that out as well. And make sure you follow my business page, which is Soul Serenity, which is my lips and my lashes. So get ready for that. Um, the business is not launched yet, but it'll be launching. It'll be launching hopefully very soon. So yeah, that's all. Bye.